good morning uh, in today's video we will be discussing a very important topic regarding assignment books so in this video this will be a two part video so in the first part we will be i'll be discussing how the assignments are designed and in the second part we will be discussing how you as a parent can use this book to track your kids progress so coming to the first part how the assignments are designed so first let's discuss about the book structure so in each level so each level we will be having two books book a and book b so book b will have week 1 week 2 week 3 and week 4 at the end we will be having assessment practice assessment practice after all this is done we will have the assessment so the same thing for book b also we will have week 1, week 2, week 3, week 4 assessment practice and then we will be having the assessment. So assessment syllabus and practice papers are already, already given in the book. So they can practice easily and in case if they want more practice they can use our website. And uh, so this book 1, book A and book B combinedly it will take around 10 to 11 weeks. So this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Here also we will have 5 weeks so around 10 to 11 weeks for each level. So in total we are having 8 levels. So level 1, 2, level 6, again you will have advanced level 1, advanced level 2. So in each level you will be having 2-2 two, two books except first level. So first level it's very different. So from second level onwards you will be having 2-2 two, two books. So this is about the book structure and uh, now let's come back to this. So first thing is, uh, today let's say I am teaching this concept called as 2 digit into 2 digit. So what we generally do is, so if there is any new concept in the book, we will always give it in the first week or second week so that the practice is more. So they have more practice questions week up to week 1 to week 4. We don't give it in the week 4, why? Because they will have less practice. So they will only have one week to practice. And so today we, we, have, we started with 2 digits into 2 digits. So we will have it in the book week one so what we do we'll teach in the class for this will take around 45 minutes of time and after that uh, we'll solve this topics question in the book so we'll solve this topics question in the book in the class and after that we give homework so each and every week we'll be having one one week so week one should be done in first week week two second week like that so on uh, we'll complete the whole book in five weeks so this is how we design the assignments and let's say sometimes what happens is you'll not have any new concept in the whole book so at that time what happens you'll not have any new concept the old concepts what you have whatever you have learned in last level so that will be repeated so you'll have uh, you have to practice those questions so that the concept becomes easier and along with that it's not like that every time you'll have all the new concepts you might have only one new concept in one book sometimes what happens you'll have three to four new concepts in each book so it completely depends on level to level so let's say you don't have any new concept so you'll have the previous previous levels on previous levels uh, topics if you have any new concept from that book onwards you'll have continuation of that concept okay so it's like let's say in level one it's very basic level you learn addition and subtraction so that addition and subtraction will be continued up to last level okay so Let's say you learned this this one you learned 2D into 2D in level 4. This will be continued up to last level. So it's like cumulative. So level 1, whatever you have learned, this is level 1, this is level 8. Whatever you have learned in level 1, you will be learning through level 8. Whatever you have learned in level 2, you learn up to level 8. So whatever you have learned in level 7, the same thing you learn in level 8. So the concept is not same like it's uh, it's like extension so let's say you, you have learned 2d into 1d in third level but you will not do the same 2d into 1d in eighth level you will learn the extension so like extension means 2d into 1d is the first concept in multiplication next is 2d into 2d next you'll have 3d into 1d so it's like this you'll have some extensions 4d into 1d next you'll have 3d into 2d all this is extension of this so you'll not learn 2D into 1D again in 8th level, you'll learn 3D into 2D in 8th level. So it's like that. 
so all the concepts will be like this this is example for multiplication the same thing for divisions decimals addition subtraction flashcards all of them you will have the format is same in all the books okay so i'll show you the example so all the books will be having so all the levels will be having two levels book a and book b so this is front side this is back side and all of the books will be having galaxy theme okay so so there are many tables in this book i'll be explaining what are them 